Achieving Horror Stories. As everyone knows, VTubers can be super scuffed, myself included. So I've asked you guys what your VTubing horror stories are. So let's hear some stories from other VTubers, shall we? I had a birthday subathon. I was prepared to do a lot of fun stuff, but it kind of turned out not to be as fun or exciting as others made it out to be. I kind of promised myself I would never do one again because of how badly it failed. Oh my god, don't we know how that's like. Subathons in VTubing are like very hit or miss. Sometimes they're good, and sometimes they make you want to f*** yourself. But either way, they can be fun, right? Right? Look, this is why we have managers to deal with this shit. We don't do it ourselves. I saw my reflection during a dark moment in a game. Oh my god, it was horrifying. Just turned around in the game and just like... Oh wait, that's me. Oh. Damn, I'm horrifying. Dude, I do that to myself in the morning every fucking day. I know the feeling, I'm so sorry. Prepared for something a year in advance, but we only started putting it together a month before due date. Never again, so I thought. It is like that, isn't it, you know? You're just like, I've got to go in, and I'm going to have everything planned out, and it's all going to be fine, and nothing will go wrong because I've planned for months and months, and next thing you know, it's the day beforehand, and you're there, and you're like, oh my god, I didn't get anything done, I had to pull an all-nighter. And then the day comes, you haven't gotten any sleep, and then, and then it's just suffering, it's just suffering, because you haven't slept, nothing's going right, everything is scuffed, you realize you missed shit. Oh my god, I know. I know the feeling. I know the feeling. I'm so sorry for you. I'm so I know this feeling, dude. Oh, ah, oh, pain. Sio Necrosis felt the uncontrollable urge to shove a large, long object into <laughs> into my model's butt. The trauma. The trauma. What? You you wanna you wanna run this by me again? You did what to your what? <laughs> I feel like I'm missing on some streams that I really should be attending at this point. Um... <laughs> you got some clips? Nothing horrific has happened just yet, thank god. But I learned accidental upskirts happen way more than I thought would happen during any kind of recorded live moment. Even in VR chat it's happened. <laughs> Physics go <brr. laughs> So I'm going to add black blur, black shorts toggle just so I can always feel safer. Fucking you go, girl. Listen, no, listen, no. It's a great way to pull in viewers if you ask me, but you know, that's just my opinion. The websites you're streaming on might not like it so much, though. You know, like Twitch, they ban shit like this all the time. You know, upskirts, accidental boot flashes. But you know, they're in the back going, yeah, boy, all the time. You know, they're they're in the back going, yeah, that's the good shit. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we've been waiting for, baby. You know that's what they're like. Had my PC blow up into flames, I... N what? Now I don't have a PC anymore, and it was all because the guy said the sound pitch wasn't an issue now. A part of my room got a nice explosion ash spot. Don't worry, it exploded when I was at work. What? This is a lot to process. This is a lot to process. Hang on. Your PC blew up because some guy said the sound pitch wasn't an issue and you were at work, so you weren't even home. Do I need to call somebody? Do you need help? I once went about six full streams without any commentary because OBS reset my mic settings and I didn't notice. An entire playthrough of a game had nothing from me and I didn't know till a mate came in and asked why I wasn't talking. I wanna fucking know. I wanna know from the people who were in the chat. I'm assuming there were more than just that person in the chat. I'm assuming there was more than one person. Why don't you ever say anything? Why do you let us suffer like this? Tell us when something goes wrong, you pieces of shit! My god! I had someone tell me that when I die and face Allah, he will see through my lies and judge me. I think it was because I have boobs and a masculine sounding voice. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and say that that person probably had a boner and was having a lot of thoughts going on in their head at the time. And they just decided to blame it on you! That's probably what happened! This person gave me a boner, so I'm gonna send them to Allah for judgment! Because! because that's how I like to imagine it went down. 
was doing my very first biggish collab, and on this particular day, my computer decided to shit itself midstream. Well, I've been there all the time, all the fucking time. My computer, oh my god. Oh my god. Voice mod was acting up. The computer was slower than usual. Audio settings were fucked. An in-game graphical bug involving blood splatter hindered my view. I don't know about you, but I believe your PC is trying to tell you something, my boy. You should probably listen closely to what it's trying to say, because that sounds like a PC is screaming out for help, and I don't know what to do about that. But you should probably do something about that. Maybe an exorcist, some holy water. Your PC may be possessed. It may be possessed, in all honesty. If you hear static in the nighttime, there's no help for you. You're fucked. Absolutely, 100% fucked. fucked. So there was this one time someone was streaming, I joined the chat and started shitposting. Pretty terrifying, yes, yes. Oh, you're one of those. Uh. Something incredibly strange happened with my model for a good while. There were some blend shapes started moving the wrong polygons in a truly terrifying way. I found it! Yes, this is my model's supposed face. <laughs> God of War, I played almost five hours of two. Was talking and doing everything like normal stream, only to realize I never went live. <laughs> oh, you silly, silly little boy. <laughs> Although I feel like a bunch of VTubers have done this, let's be honest. I haven't done this myself, but one day, one day I probably will. Knowing me. Knowing me, I probably will. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah! I spent a month building a rig to allow chat to control my monitor with redeems and bits. I coded stuff on a Raspberry Pi and hooked it up to a TV. First test right before stream, power cut. That broke something in the code and I spent an extra week fixing it. I cried. A lot. Oh god, I'm so sorry. That pains me to read. That, that made, that pain, that pained me to read, honestly. <laughs> it gets better, I promise. No, I don't. Took me two years to debut. Listen, there are some people that still have pre-debut never names, and it's been like, come on, it, it, it's been, it's since 2020, come on. Come on. You've debuted. I have two. Both are funny and involve people trying to start shit with me on stream. First one, during a drunk stream, I had someone randomly come in and call me fat, so I told him I'm fat because every time I fuck his mom, <laughs> she gives me a biscuit! Ah! <laughs> come here, doll. Let mommy come give you a special biscuit. I don't know why I gave her chain smoker's voice. I have no idea, but oh my god. Oh my god, that's fucking amazing. That was a perfect comeback. 10 out of 10. Second, during a splat stream, I had someone tell me to off myself. I told him I was a visual learner and to show me how to do it correctly first. Dude told me that I wouldn't say it to his face, so I told him to pull up at a con I was going to so I could. Bro pushed out. Ah! Is like, oh yeah, meet me outside the McDonald's car park, you scrub. And then, like, they just never show up. Fucking cowards. You scared of short people? I'm gonna bite your ankles, boy. I'm gonna bite your ankles. Come here. Come here. I'm gonna bite. Ah! <laughs> That's all the stories we have for today, guys. If you have any more stories, feel free to submit them to me, and I will do another one of these videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time for more VTuber Horror Stories! What's up, Spark? Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you again soon. And please consider giving a like and subscribe to the channel to help support me. Bye-bye!